So right now we are at Beach Mountain. It's only a four mile winding hike up from the base of the mountain, but once you're up here, it's a small knit community with only 300 people living here year round. Now, it's like Mayberry meets a ski resort. It's beautiful and quaint. Okay, so let's go see what it's all about. Okay, so our first stop is breakfast, and we're stopping at Fred's General Mercantile. This is one of the gems of Beach Mountain. It has everything from sleds to tools, and one of the most important thing is breakfast. Now, not a lot of people know about this, and we couldn't even find it on Yelp, but this is one of the best breakfasts in town. So we're gonna go check it out and see how it is. Okay, now Fred's is the best deal on the mountain. They've been open every day since 1979. You can come here for anything, including breakfast, which for $5.29, you can get two eggs, bacon, country ham, and mountain grits. Now I'm ready to go and enjoy this delicious food. Now this is great. We just discovered the sledding hill right next to the Visitors Bureau. It's funded by the city, so it's free for everyone. You'll see a lot of families out here, and especially on snow days, you'll see the kids come out here with their sleds and have a great time. And we are finally here at Beach Mountain. We are at 5,500 feet, and I've never been skiing before. As you guys can see, there's skiers behind me and snowboarders, and this is considered the ski school, and I will be here in a little bit, and hopefully I don't fall and hurt myself. I think I'll be fine, but this is my first time, and let's see how it goes. Hi, Melissa, this is Andy. I'm welcome to Beach Mountain, and I'm here to teach you how to ski today. There are three important things to remember when you're learning how to ski. One, stance. Keep your, keep your feet shoulder width apart, flex your ankles, knees, and hips. Two, speed control. Use wide turns to control your speed as you go down the mountain. And most importantly, number three is safety. Always watch for obstacles and other people around you, and please try not to knock anybody over. Okay, so you guys never know what you're gonna find here. Right behind me, they're in the middle of doing a bikini skiing contest. To the right, they're still in ski schools. Tomorrow is a box sledding competition, so it's all adventure and all fun here. Okay, I have found the perfect place to go right before dinner. It's just off of Beach Mountain and it's Banner Elk Winery, owned by Dick Wolf. He is revolutionizing North Carolina wine. Not only are they growing the grapes here, but they're also bottling the wine here. I'm gonna grab a quick drink and see what this award-winning wine is all about. Okay, so our final destination here at Beach Mountain is Jackalope's View Restaurant. Now, I've heard some really great things about it. It's southern style cooking, meets a classically trained European chef, and the dress is casual. As you'll see behind me, there's corks. These corks were opened from the wine bottles here in this restaurant. I cannot wait to try the food, and I've had a fantastic time here at Beach Mountain. I can't wait to come back. 